this is perfectly fine by me. All right, you guys ready to grab some games? Who's ready? Raise your hand. Augers in chat if you're ready, I guess. I've never asked for something in chat. Uh, Nene's in chat if you're ready. Nene, oh, I guess I have asked for Nene's in the past. Oh, this is interesting. Ooh. Uh, they hate. They hate Moltres. <laughs> like, actually. They also kind of hate Landorus, if I can get it on the field without rocking anything. Um... I don't want to lead off with Spectre, because it's it's I need to get rid of Ndidi first. So I think leading off Moltres Clefairy is actually fine. Uh in the back here, Landorus. Spectre doesn't seem bad at all, but Heatran could also be pretty heat. Heatran's actually kind of really good. I just have to get rid of this thing in Heatran walls. Let's go, Heatran. Oh yo? I mean they're just gonna go for Trick Room. They're literally just gonna go for Trick Room. Fiery Wrath. I could Nasty Plot here. I kinda want a Nasty Plot and Protect and then follow me next turn. Mystical Fire, that's fine. Cool. Let's Fiery Wrath now and follow me. They shouldn't eat this very well and they have a chance to get flinched. I wish I had Helping Hand, but I felt like Icy Wind was just a little bit better. Okay, it is always correct here to go for the, uh, it is always correct to, uh, the Icy Wind here and give them a Defiant boost and just tell them to deal with it. Actually, no, I still just... I Fiery Wrath this turn and follow me. Because it's not like... Like, Taunt could be annoying, right? But yeah, they're just going to U-turn. This doesn't like it either. This could get flinched out as well. Fiery Wrath... Uh, I'm pretty sure I just Icy Wind here again. Not crit kiss. We take very little damage. It is now slower. They could have followed me on this thing, but I'd imagine they're not doubling down on follow me users. They revealed Slowbur in the back, so I'm actually pretty hesitant to... Uh... I air slash here and I followed me. Don't you turn. Okay, cool. They drill packed. Yeah, this was correct because now their entire team loses to Heatran and I just send it out and we're like, fine. Yeah, cool. Um, I go for Fiery Wrath. And actually, I should just Air Slash. Uh, Air Slash Heat Wave. Uh, maybe I just Fiery Wrath. GG. Fiery Wrath Heat Wave's fine. I don't lose to Slow Bro. <laughs> nice. You turn out of the game. Nice. Okay, cool. Cool, cool, cool. Very nice first game. Very good display of the Moltres. And honestly, I think Moltres can be good in this format. It's just a matter of making sure your Clefairy stays healthy enough for it to work. Why Flamethrower over Flash Cannon or Sub? I don't know. I didn't make the set. I think it's just the Bypass Wide Guard. My buddy Jack made the set and I'm just using it. Uh, also, it's it's for, um, sorry, Amoongus, because Rage Powder Amoongus can be annoying. My Landorus lead here is like oppressively good, but I have to be very careful. I think it's best to lead off with, um, it's best to lead off with Moltres. And Clefairy, but I bring the Lando. And I'm somewhat tempted to bring Spectre, but I know that Rillaboom's probably safer. 
Yeah. Okay, they let off pretty much how I wanted them to lead off. Let's protect here. Nah. I mean, they're gonna Electroweb, right? They should Electroweb. This is gonna be something I regret doing, but I will do it anyways. I'm gonna do it anyways. I'm gonna regret doing it, but I will do it anyways. Because I want to get rid of Zapdos like ASAP. It makes my Lando so much better. Because Lando is a hard wall to Regia Lucky. I just can't give this thing a... I can't let this thing get a Defiant boost and be like fast. You know what I mean? Okay. Well, now it's going to have both. However, um, I should live this with my friend guard so I can always just air slash an Icy Wind again. And as long as this thing remains slower than me, I'm fine. Okay, I am wrong. Alright, do you guys want to see the actual play that will blow your mind? They're never going to see it coming. 24, this thing's too fast, I lose. <laughs> It is simply too fast, I lose. I thought maybe I could get away with that. I thought maybe they would be like, yeah, I can just KO. Because I, I couldn't, how do I say it? I couldn't uh, follow me there, so I was hoping they would just take the bait. All right, be faster somehow. Incredible. Don't get me wrong. If they have a Rillaboom, this is still winnable. If they brought the Rillaboom, this is still totally winnable. They should protect the Nihiligo here. No, they won't. They're cowards. Okay, cool. They're gonna switch it out. I'm gonna Icy Wind. I'm crazy. They're gonna switch it out and Volt Switch on me. Because I'm, I'm insane. They have no clue. They think I'm in a Helping Hand, but they don't know. Well, I guess they should know that I have Follow Me as my last move, but maybe they'll take the bait. They switched it. Let's go. Let's go. You guys might not believe me right now, but this is totally doable. You guys still don't believe me, but this is still totally doable. Once again, you guys doubt my ability to win this match with uh, with resisted moves, but it is 100% doable. Okay, good game. <laughs> I was lying to myself and you. Okay, this is kind of a cool team. Spectre goes kind of crazy here as long as they don't have crunch. Um, they're also usually Chapelberry and not Shookaberry. So I do really like the Spectre lead. I actually like Spectre, Moltres, Clefairy, Lando. Okay, yeah, this isn't that bad. Um... Probably inner focus on the Entei. I would like to slow it down in case it's like Scarf or something. So let's go for Mud Shot here. And let's go into our Clefairy. I get that call wrong, but it's not actually that bad since I am able to just Nasty Plot here and they don't have too many answers. Uh, let's nasty plot and I'm gonna protect. <coughs> oh, I didn't say GLHF. 
How do you see the rating above their name, bro? I just noticed that. It's just something I have from like my, my custom showdown thing. Okay. Um, my play here is going to be to go for a Fiery Wrath and switch in my Lando to get an Intimidate on the stack. And then next turn, I should be able to go right back in, into my dude. Flinch? I just need to flinch the stack and I like am totally fine. Let's go! Earth power is always safe. Air slash is always safe. That doesn't KO me. GG's. Yeah, I figured they wouldn't be Shooka. Alright. Uh, I can always go for Fiery Wrath here. KO the Entei. Go Clefairy. Easy live. A little bit of a burn. A little bit of a berserk. A little bit of a berry. Good game. Do I get my berserk again after that? Oh, it doesn't activate again? Coward? Coward of an ability. It doesn't activate again. Okay. I mean, this is just good stuff standards. Um... However, I do still really like the Moltres this game, and also, like, like, let's be real, the Lando goes insane on this team. I can't lead off with it, though. I cannot lead off with it. E-Tran's a little unsafe. I gotta stop getting distracted. I'm, like, missing out on my good sportsmanship skills. Good sportsmanship. My good sportsmanly, like, conduct and stuff. I... I I'm gonna say good luck, have fun. That's what I'm forgetting to do. All right. Um, the Spectre Moltres lead actually goes hard due to the speed control that I have via Mudshot. Uh, and I can bring Clefairy in the back in Lando. Oh my, it's Suicune. Suicune. All right. Um... It is always correct to do this. I care not for what my opponent might think. Mudshot you and protect. I don't think they double the spec. They could be helping hand Suicune. I'm pretty sure it gets it. Dragon Pulse. Are they Shadow Ball? Or Snarl, that might do it. No, it doesn't. Okay, cool. I only needed that, really. That's all I needed. That's now in range. Uh, I can go for a Fiery Wrath and get my Clefairy in. They might call it. Cool. I'm going to Nasty Plot and Protect here. I'm crazy. I'm crazy. All right, uh, let's go for another Fiery Wrath. I think I just switch out here. Where could Icy win? Because I want to keep my Clef. I should eat this. Like, realistically, this should be easy to eat. Yeah, I think I hand over Spectre, if anything. Yeah, I just barely live, which is really nice. I'm going to KO this thing. I'm already at plus three. Their answers for this thing are getting low. Um, I should eat a hit from Tapu Koko. I think I'm just going to Fiery Wrath to try to KO the Suicune, because how much did I do? I did 49%? That's not enough. Actually, it should be enough. Let's get in Clefairy to help me live this. I think I can live it. As long as they're not specs, I should be fine. Oh, yo. And now I actually have like tools. What is on one? Go for Fiery Wrath and follow me. As soon as I get rid of the speed control, this becomes like a Lando game for sure. Nice, back up to my thing. I get my berry back. This is kind of an insane combo, if we're being real. 
Yeah, I win with Lando. I just go for another Fiery Wrath and uh, follow me. I guess they could Gleam, but now I just totally KO this. Plus three. Oh, they flinched me. Okay, that's fine. Like I said, though, Lando goes Insano mode. Insano mode. Little known fact. I think I protect here. And I actually go for um, Earth Power on you first. Just in case they protect the Coco. Yeah. That's what I thought. Cool. Um, Shadow Ball onto you. Earth Power onto you. Because I want to make sure I get damage on Lando to win the 1v1. Yeah. Cool. That's my best move. I think I should just win with Sludge Bomb. Yeah, it's not like they can flinch me. That should be a win. Yeah, I get the poison. Let's go. Let's go. GG. Well played. 1400. This team goes this team goes a little stupid. Quick question. What's really good speed tier to hit in your opinion, not counting Reggie Alecki? You wanna if it depends. Um if you're trying to outspeed things with Icy Wind. 130 so you want to hit like um 134 which is 201 divided by 1.5 i actually did that calc earlier today because that lets you outspeed spectrier and tapu coco um and if you want to outspeed dragapult you want to dragapult's always running clear not clear body yeah clear body uh so it's very rare that you'll actually be able to slow it down with icy wind so that's like a tailwind speed stat so like 107 is what outspeeds dragapult at plus two um and 108 to speed creep if you're running like slower pokemon like tapu finny i tend to hit 108 with because a lot of pokemon will hit 107 and you want to speed creep the 107s it's it's weird but yeah all right this is kind of scary it's probably just like blocephalon flash fire stuff um Nothing that Lando can't really deal with. Also, I have my Heatran. I could pretty reasonably lead off like this. Moltres, Landorus, Clefairy, Heatran. No problem, dude. By the way, guys, tonight, a uh, a new episode of my Patreon laddering series goes live. If you want to check it out, $5 a month unlocks you two extra videos every month. Um, and $1 a month gets your name at the end of all of my uh, lore videos. So yeah, link, in, link right here, you know, exclamation point Patreon if you want my support. That helps me out quite a bit. What's been your favorite Mondo experiment uh, with in Spike Myth, by the way? I think Noivern is actually my favorite Mon to experiment with, but my favorite Mon to use, probably just straight up like Urshifu. I like clicking buttons, getting KOs. I like any Choice Bandit Urshifu. As long as I'm able to play it effectively, Choice Bandit Urshifu feels like free points, you know? Crush Grip Regigigas was also a fun meme. Life spot actually good, bro. I mean, it can be. I, I'm I'm gonna try it out. That is that's on my to do list. But right now, I really like this team. This team feels great. That's what I really appreciate about this format is that nothing feels so broken that you can like complain about it. You know, nothing feels that broken. This guy's just kind of AFK, isn't he? a little afk just a little just a little bit afk
I think he might not be here. He may just be absent. It's just gonna be the it's it's gonna be the Whimsicott lead, isn't it? Warrior Seed Wim plus Crush Grip Reggie is so fun. Don't run Wim. A lot of people say I don't like Weezing because Weezing has to be on the field but to, to use Regigigas effectively. Listen, if you're not running Weezing on a Regigigas team, you are pretty much just throwing. You are pretty much just throwing. Why why are you throwing by, by doing that? Simple. Um, if you don't have uh, Weezing on your team, you are not able to protect on Urshifu close combat. You are not able to avoid the uh, Incineroar Intimidates. Regigigas works so well in a vacuum of no abilities that not having a Weezing and just deciding to Worry Seed set up and hope that you are able to, you know, not have to switch your Regigigas is is too much of a, of a gamble. Also, Weezing allows you to pivot around with your Regigigas, which is something that a lot of people tend to underestimate the value of. Flinch. No? Okay, that's fine. I'm pretty sure this person's AFK. But yeah, also wheezing. I get the comment a lot. Like every time I mention like Regigigas wheezing in a video, there's someone that does mention Whimsicott with Worry Seed. But the issue with Worry Seed is literally just the fact that you have to use the Whimsicott to set it up where the wheezing can just exist. And yeah, Wimscott has some tools like Tailwind and stuff, but I'd, I'd take the Weezing any day over Wimscott purely because I'm able to switch out my Regigigas without being like, oh no, my setup's gone, you know? I wonder if they're actually AFK. They have to be. No, they're just they're just gone. But I also can't, like, stop playing. Have you guys built anything interesting in, uh, in Spike Myth Cup yet? Anything look crazy? I would argue this is my most standard team yet, but it's still probably one of my most reliable. I find this guy, I find this team to be quite, uh, quite fun. Yeah, these are like the, the teams, that, all, all of these, one, two, three, four, five, six, these are like the six teams I'm comfortable playing with. All right, I get spored, but nothing really beats the, you know, the thing. Sorry, my opponent's AFK. <laughs> I've been Latios, Zapdos, G, Sylveon, Suicune, Rillaboom, and Sin. That's pretty fun. Body Press, Glacier. I will say that, like, I, I the plot twist of uh, Body Press, Glacier probably being the best set for it in non Dynamax was not something that I expected, but it sort of makes sense. Helping and Sport. They're AFK. This is just the game selecting the first move in their, in their uh, arsenal. There they go. Okay, cool. Uh, I can just go for Fiery Wrath, Rock Tomb, and let's just grab another game. Like we, there's, there's no way that we actually lose that one. So let's actually get, let's get another game. Let's just get another game. I haven't really gotten to use Spectrier too effectively. I kind of want to do that. Imagine if Spectrier got access to Trick Room. That'd be really good. Like even though it's fast, Sash Trick Room could be like a viable move set on it. Oh, speak of Kamoa, I'm pretty sure we just mentioned that dude. Um, they really hate Spectrier. I feel like we face Enrico every time I stream. <clears throat> yeah, let's do this. I don't know if I want Rillaboom. I think I still want Moltres. Actually, man... Did they outspeed me? They didn't. Okay, cool. Fiery Wrath, Rock Tomb. Actually, I'm going to lead off Moltres. 
Ultra Spectre, Clefairy, um, because it gives me options in Lando. Special attacking Lando actually does really well into bulk up stuff. Hmm. Let's protect. Let's just double protect, actually. Are there ongoing Spike Myth tours on Switch? Uh, there were some earlier today. Oh, that might be really bad, actually. Let's just go for damage. Maybe I'll get a spit-off drop. That'd be really useful. Flinch? Epic flinch. Epic, epic flinch. No one can say it wasn't earned, because it 100% was. You are a liar and a scoundrel if you said I didn't earn that flinch. Let's go Clefairy and just go for the Shadow Ball there. Special Defense Drop. Awesome. Liars, scoundrels, the lot of you. Alright, um... Wish I had a Helping Hand Sludge Bomb. How much did my air slash do? 18%. I think I can get Sludge Bomb from this range if I follow me. It's gonna be a really rough end game. I'm hoping that they're running Scald. I mean, I can live the hit with Friend Guard, but eh, I just protect actually. I can live whatever because I'm a Salt Vest, but it could be annoying. All right. Let's go. All right, let's go Moltres here and... Hmm. Are they going to protect here? One would imagine they would, but I should still just attack. Yep. As they trick room. That's fine. Uh, Air Slash should pick up from this range, so we'll go into Clefairy. All right. That body press did more than I'm comfortable with. TBH. TBH. Let's go for protect earth power. This thing's at minus one. I mean, like, I just want to make sure I can actually KO it because this is going to be a rough end game. I don't take a flare blitz too well. Yikes. Um, it's at minus one. It's, it is it is at minus one, but what I will say is that uh, it's not worth risking. <laughs> Do I Fiery Wrath here? I think I go for the 30%, like every time. Because whatever's in the back, my Moltres should be slower. I go for the 30% like every time. Let's go! It's 100% skill. Concentrated power or will. All right, Fiery Wrath, um, U-turn. I hope I'm slower. I am slower, okay, cool, flinch. 100% skill, I just have to sludge bomb poison and I should win. Hopefully he doesn't have Ice Punch. And hopefully he is just the body press set. <laughs> but I don't think he is. Oh, is he choice pinned? Because he shouldn't Drain Punch there otherwise. Poison? I mean, if he just if he's just doing this, I should win in the long run. It might be banded. Yeah, it's doing too much to not be banded. I just have to poison and I'm good. Let's go! It ate a citrus berry. It's not banded. It's just simply choosing to do this. I'm a little concerned. Okay, hear me out. My play here is going to be to Rock Tomb. And then next turn I KO. I think. I need to be faster than you, don't I? 
Don't miss. Okay, I'm now faster. Sludge Bomb. Does Earth Power do it from this range? I don't know. I don't know why I was clicking Sludge Bomb. I should have been clicking Earth Power this whole time. I forgot I had it because I'm stupid. Sorry. I was I was having a brain fart. I was like, yeah, Sludge Bomb. The only move that my Landorus runs. And I'm like, oh wait, Earth Power is right there. Marcos stopped streaming right after 10 hours of work. <laughs>